it's just an incredible incredible day right it's an incredible day uh and it's an important day um it's something that i don't think any of us uh, expected to happen uh, i thought this was going to drag on for months if not years longer where assange would finally die in prison and uh, he's not dying in prison that is a win that is a win right sure uh judge napoleon atano said he's not happy about the government get getting their how did he phrase it uh, chunk of meat or something like this uh, but so be it you can't win every battle but this is a war that assange just won right he, he took hits he took hits uh, I hope he lives a long, healthy life. I hope he has an opportunity to to meditate, to uh, to eat well, to get some therapy, mental, physical, emotional. Uh, I hope his family stays tight. I personally, if I was Assange and Assange's family, I would thank everyone. Come on and say thank you, everyone, for your support. Uh, but we need family time and I would disappear for a while to tell you the truth I would just shut it all down uh, go to the beach go to a cabin and uh, just turn it all off turn it off read books read comic books personally I would do but I would read books philosophy books and books that aren't about politics and economics and geopolitics but more about uh, more esoteric stuff more spiritual stuff more nature stuff uh, if I had you know any uh, recommendation to give to Assange that would be it uh, he he brought the race to this point and he's passed the baton on to us right it's it's time for the army of supporters of those that he has awakened to take the mantle to take the baton and go with it and uh, he doesn't need to watch the progression of the race he needs to step away in my humble opinion and uh, close the doors on the outside world and educate his two children uh, to uh, to not be polluted uh, poisoned by the the fame the the pressures uh, the the society that we live in right now and he 100% needs to educate uh, I'm pretty sure he knows this uh, educate his sons and hopefully more children to come uh, on a homeschool basis and not send them to any centralized indoctrination centers uh, and i'm pretty sure he's going to have an army of supporters of uh, colleagues of family that are going to act as a shield to protect him and his family from any outside uh, even fans or pressures that are going to come his way uh, and I hope he lives uh, he lives a long happy life and if if we never hear from him again if he decides to retire for good and uh, never uh, engage with the public again uh, more power to him and if he decides to come back more power to him whatever he decides it's on the up and up right it's on the up and up